Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing this morning? I'm hanging in there. I am hanging in there, y'all. I'm trying to get my camera right. Y'all have to excuse me because, you know, I never had my ducks in a row. Long time no see. Haven't been up here for a while. But I've been busy. You already know. I've, I've been busy and you already know what I've been doing. I didn't forget about the YouTubers in the YouTube community. I've been watching YouTube all day, every day. That's what I do. I watch YouTube. And as a matter of fact, I don't even hardly watch any other uh, any other TV. I watched a movie the other day, which was kind of interesting. But you know what? I forgot what the movie was about. Isn't that crazy? I have to think about it to, you know, I have to remember what it was about. But I usually watch a movie when I'm laying in, when I'm lying in bed. What is it? Laying in bed or lying in bed? Lay means the place. Lying in bed. I think I was lying in bed. I'm trying to use better English too, y'all, at the same time. Uh, not necessarily so, though. Everybody else talks slack, so I'm going to slack right along with them. And uh, no sense in trying to change it. This ain't, no, you know what they always say. It's a bad wind that don't never change. So, I'm trying to do better. I'm trying to improve my, my speech, my language, and everything like that as I go. Uh, what have I been up to? Uh, not much, just like I said, hanging around, been downtown, hanging out with my sister, hung out with her, had lunch, and, uh, what else did I do? Hmm, I can't think of anything important that I did. Well, my life is not really that exciting. I don't have a lot going on, uh, right now, you know? So I sort of, it's all routine. It's like a, everything is routine. Get up in the morning, have breakfast, take pills, crochet, whatever, play Scrabble. Scrabble. Mm. And what's the other game that I play? I play, um, um, connect, not connect. What am I talking about, connect? I play, um. Uh, Hmm, what's the name of the game? I don't forgot the name of the game many times I play. But anyway, it's about the farmer. He trying to save his animals from going over the fence. And so I play that. It'll come to me after a while, yeah. And uh, what else do I do during the day? Clean up a little bit. And I do mean a little bit. I try to keep the dishes out the sink. But today, today is going to... What's today? Today is a mopping day because I did not mop yesterday. I was one lazy sister yesterday, y'all. I didn't do hardly anything. I was laying around and playing around. That was it. And uh, so today it's going to be, you know, the mopping of the areas. I'm not looking forward to it. But once I get started, it doesn't take long. doesn't take long at all. But let's go outside. Let's go outside and check on Pinky. You know, I haven't checked on Pinky for a couple of days. I've, I've seen her from the, you know, I bet it, oh, she shouldn't go outside showing all my wrinkles when I do it this way. But anyway, I'm just going to go out here to see Pinky. Leave the door open. And uh, try not to frown too much. Um... There she is, yeah. Not much change. I went to wear my sunglasses. It's burning, filling my eyes. See the little buds on the, on the tree? The little buds are up all the way up here. I am here. And Pinky is way up there. I wish, I wish upon wish that I knew what type of tree that was. But I don't, still don't know, y'all. I'm waiting. I was waiting for something to happen, but it looks like, 
Oh, excuse me. It looks like nothing is going to happen except for the buds that are out there. So, I guess that's what it's going to be, buds. I thought maybe, I, okay, maybe it's a fruit tree. Uh, you know, a pears or apples of some sort or something. But the blossoms that came on the tree were pink. Oh, turn the light off. Look what... Can you see them spider webs on my mailbox? Yeah. Look at that. Now, when I came out here the other day, the whole inside of the, uh, the whole inside of the mailbox was uh, covered with webs, and I got my raid and sprayed, sprayed inside of there. I don't know where the spider went. I don't know if I, I'm, I'm assuming that I killed them. That's a fire truck. I live right down the street from the firehouse, y'all. No, that was an ambulance. I don't know. I don't know what went down. But anyway, they went down the street. I'm gonna get back in the house. I can't take insects. I was thinking about buying one of those things, you know, with the, what you call, some kind of, I don't know if it's an RV light, you know, with the blue light on it that keeps the insects away. And I wanted to get one to hang up on my patio. And then I think they cost like $34. And I was saying to myself, do I want to put out $34 for that? Or do I just want to stay in the house and just let the flies have the outside and I got the inside? I hold down the inside, let them hold down the outside. But I'm still contemplating, I'm still thinking about it because I could be sitting out there on the porch, you know, in the morning. And, uh, do I, you know, I still crochet even in the summertime. But if I'm going to sit on the porch, that's going to cause my hands to sweat. And so... I have to do my crocheting inside where it's nice and cool. And then I got my, you know, my air if it gets real hot. Which I haven't actually had my air on this year yet. I don't think I even had it on once. Because, first of all, it hasn't been that cold. It's been kind of, um, I mean, it hasn't been that warm. What am I talking about? I'm trying to get some room here on the desk to set this. Bad boy down. But it hasn't been that hot yet. Not to me anyway. Because I still got my cover on my bed. I got my blankets on my bed. I am still chilling. I am <laughs> really snuggling down in snuggling down in my bed. Uh, so to me now, I don't know where to... I think we had maybe a couple of hot days last week. I think I got down to like uh, up to, should I say, maybe uh, 90 one day. Or was it two days? I forgot. I was in the house. I'd be in the house like that anyway. And then I don't go out on my scooter, you know, when it's real hot like that. Guess what, y'all? Let me show you what I cooked it for breakfast this morning. What, what I, I don't know if I burnt them. I don't know. I just don't, you know. I don't know how to use that air fryer. Let me see if I can hold this up. These are some potatoes that I, can you see that? There's some potatoes that I had fried and they are hot too, y'all. Don't think I had I put too much pepper. I put cayenne on them. And boy, I'm telling you, my ears were, you know, they was burning, blowing or whatever you call it when, you, when it's too hot. And my eyes, and then... My nose who started to run, I said, oh, sugar. And <laughs> I have overdone it this time. And so, and I had, well, I had black pepper on. Actually, yesterday morning for the, for the breakfast, too, I also made the potatoes, okay? So I'm trying to new and improve it today. Yesterday, I did not put any cayenne on them. So today, I said, okay. Okay, we're going to try it with some cayenne. Give it a little bit of kick. And I had the ground cayenne. You know, the, 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 
the powdery looking one, the one that's ground up. And I didn't put but a little bit, along with the black pepper, of course. You know, black pepper, I don't know how to do nothing for me. Because I use I use the coarse, uh, coarse ground black pepper. But boy, I put that, <laughs> that cayenne on there. Uh-oh, somebody going to start drinking Kool-Aid. And that's what's in this cup, y'all. I had, I got grape, I don't know if you can see it, this is, I don't want to spill it, there's grape Kool-Aid in there, and I said, oh shoot, oh snap, as the young kids can say, oh snap, <laughs> and I said, I drank almost the whole cup already, and so that's what I got left, and, but I tell you, it, they would have been good. But one thing I can tell you about this uh, air fryer, let me just throw that out there at you. I don't know why they got so much rave, you know, that these air fryers got such a rave. Because I always have a problem with mine. Now, this is my second air fryer that I bought. The first one was a Kasori, but it was so big. I said, let me send it, which I didn't really like it. I used that first one one time, got it from Amazon. Used it one time, I think I fried some chicken, I put some chicken wings in there. And um, the chicken wings, they were good the first day. I said, oh, sugar, sugar, you know, sookie, sookie, whatever. And so I, they were good, they were good. And then the next day, I, I tried to heat them up or, or something. I forgot exactly what happened. But I remember them tasting rubbery. Yeah. And then I never really, really liked the air fryer anyway. I don't know why. I, and I still don't. But then I had seen this air fryer on Amazon because I was looking up there, you know, just to see if I could see a little smaller one. And I had seen... One at Walmart. I think I said this in one of my other videos. That I had seen a small one. A little. It was so cute. It was little. And so they didn't have any. Except the one that was on display. That's the only one at Walmart that had left. At this particular Walmart that I was at. And so I was looking on Amazon. And lo and behold. There is a little air fryer. But actually, the air fryer came back bigger than what, you know, the one I had seen at Walmart. But anyway, um, so far, everything I cook, it, it just ain't right. Whatever I cook in there, the, the as you could see, those potatoes over there, they hard. And then they're not done all the way through. These are raw potatoes. These are not, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, the ones like you get in the store in the frozen uh, department. I would imagine they came, they came out all right, I think, because I had tried those before, too. I think they came out okay. You know, if you buy the ones that you get from the old writer or whatever, something like that, they come out okay. At least they're edible. But I don't know. I don't know about this air fryer, y'all. I just don't know. I, I don't know what else to try in here. But, I mean, I've waited too long to send it back. Because I was looking on Amazon last night. I said, let me see if it's, you know, too late to send it back. Because I haven't had it that long. And I think it was due the last date. I think, if I'm not mistaken, was it the 18th or the 20th? 28th. I forgot. But anyway, it's, I, you know, it's too late to send it back. But I probably could talk to somebody at Amazon and explain to them what's going on. And they might just let me send it back. But I don't feel like going through that. I'm gonna try some other stuff. Maybe, maybe today I would try um, some bacon. I think you can cook bacon in there too. Cause I got some. I bought some bacon the other day, and uh, but I don't know what. Where would the grease go if I do the bacon? I got the liners. You know, this is. These are the liners that you buy, you know, for for your air fryer. It's like a big old cupcake, you know, cupcake like a lot of cup. And you just put that in there. 
Hmm. You know, I never thought about that. But I'm thinking, I seen somebody on YouTube cook some bacon in that air fryer. I don't know if it was Mrs. Brazil or was it Charlie? I don't. See, I don't think Charlie. I don't think I ever seen Charlie cook any anything in the air fryer. I'm not sure. It was somebody that I had seen. Cause this is where I got this uh, recipe. Well, this uh, idea to cook these uh, potatoes in there. So I peeled my own potatoes and seasoned my own potatoes. Do them in the air fryer. But I'm trying to think who did I I saw somebody that was cooking some bacon. You know, a lot of people cook anything anywhere. And I think you can cook ba uh, biscuits in there. I'm not sure. And I bought me some um, buttermilk the other day when I was downtown. And um, I'm going to make buttermilk biscuits. But, of course, I haven't done it yet. I had the intentions of making buttermilk, you know, buttermilk biscuits. And so I was going, oh, I had it going on. I even bought me some sausage. I was trying a different kind of sausage. I bought two different kinds of sausage. I was at Whole Foods, as a matter of fact, you know, in one of the Amazon subsidiary stores. And uh, I was there, and they had all these, you know, I saw these sausages, and then I realized, okay, these same sausages or at my regular, you know, stop and shop. But I had never tried them before. So while I'm at, you know, Whole Foods spending all this money, you know, oh, and I mean, you could spend it in a hurry in, in, in Whole Foods. You could definitely spend it in like 10 minutes. You would spend $100. And so I bought me some. Oh, I was going to do this, I was going to do that, and the third. <laughs> so, I got these two. Let me see if I can get them. Hold on, y'all. I'll show you. Hold on. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. Because I'm coming. Yes, hold on. Now, here, here is one. I never ever even bought these or or even noticed these before. But I saw them the other day when I went to my where's my uh spectacles. When I went to my regular store I saw them. Now you get four in a pack in here, just four. And they say there's plant based sausages. Smoked apple and sage and i think you know that day when me and my sister was downtown in there you know we was in whole food because they got a little area over there that you could have lunch and you could buy sandwiches in there and stuff like that and these are the plant-based wait a minute plant-based frankfurters Classic smoked frankfurters. But look at the way they're cased. You know, this is like a, a piece of metal they got tied around. I, you know, never really noticed that before. Except it sort of reminds me of the way things used to be uh, in casing when we was down south, down yonder home. And so I said, I'm going to try it because I've been looking for a, a hot dog that I can chew and some good uh, sausage. I haven't hardly seen no, uh, had no good sausage until uh, since uh, Parks. I don't know if you remember Parks when it was good sausage. I mean, it's still in the store today, but it ain't nothing like it used to be. Parks used to be what it is, you know. But this here, I don't know. We shall see. We let me put this back in the fridge, y'all. I don't know. I probably should put it in the freezer. Maybe later on. I think it was downtown Tuesday. And the day is Saturday. But I haven't. Well, 
They're individually, you know, individually uh, wrapped. See? And then they tell you, I think with this one, this one, I think they tell you to take it out of the casing, which I would imagine is this plastic on the outside. I don't know, y'all. We shall see, you know. We shall see. I might just have some today because I don't think the old girl wants to cook. Yeah, and I, and I haven't been cooking at all. I can't even hardly remember when I cooked glass. Been making sandwiches, just eating junk, junk, junk. I cook. Oh yes, I did. I cooked some chicken wings once, a couple of days ago, I guess. Other than that, mm -mm. and my granddaughter, not my granddaughter, but my uh, niece. I gotta get off the video, y'all. Ooh, I gotta hang this video up. See how time flies when you're having fun? That's because I haven't been up here to talk to the YouTube community and the YouTubers. I haven't been up here to talk up here for a long time. And I guess I'm just, time flies like they say when you're having fun. I gotta go, y'all, but I will be talking to you again soon. And I go with love.